It's Christmas Eve, so Merry Christmas, everyone. Tonight, I'm going to be sharing a quick story called The Sasquatch Before Christmas. Very cool book written by Nathan Lee and illustrated by James Allen. Hope everyone's having a wonderful night. The Santa's on his way. But first, a little tale. It was the night before Christmas when all through the wood, a creature was stirring. One misunderstood. Mm. Sorry for the glare. No stockings were hung, no chimney, nor care, just a bipedal wood ape, all covered with hair. He's found a cabin in the wood. He lumbered and growled and beat his great chest, oblivious to Christmas or any holiday jest. Doesn't seem to like snowmen either. When out in the forest, there arose such a chatter, the beast startled and roared and emptied his bladder. T'was a gunshot that boomed, an unfortunate blunder, for his wrath was now fixed on eight tiny hunters. Oh, there goes his bladder. Uh-oh. What do you think, guys? Bad news? Bad news. They had hoped to go home with some holiday treats. Sasquatch steaks, Bigfoot burgers, and other rare meats. Tip roast. But they missed, and so trembled, desperate to hide from the beast fast approaching, his mouth open wide. New pages are very hard to turn. So are old fingers. He ate Jeffrey. And Jacob, and Tristan, and Aiden, Tasty Liam, and Logan, and Henry, and Jaden. From the tips of their toes to their heads did he maul. He ate him up, ate him up. He ate them up all. Even with Santa watching. The beast may not know what Santa Claus brings. The gifts and the gadgets and the merrier thing. But the spirit of Christmas for each is unique. Ours is in giving, his is to eat. We enjoy caroling, but silence is golden for the proud forest jetty with a Jaden-filled colon. Poor Jaden. 
jolly he now felt, and in true Christmas fashion, he aimed to express his new holiday passion. He's wearing Jaden's outfit. I heard him exclaim, ere out of sight he walked, Whoa! Because Bigfoots can't talk. The Sasquatch before Christmas. Merry Christmas, everybody. Hope it's fantastic. It's filled with love and cheer because that's what we all deserve this time of year. <laughs>